What's up, peeps? Peace, two fingers. I'm in a sweeper today. So my buddy asked me to give a little tutorial on um, the sweeper because he's trying to promote at his job. So I finally uh, got a time to do it because I'm in it. But anyway, let's get it started real quick. See this right here? This is the power uh, PTO. Power take off. Turn that on first. Turn your key on for the panel, your control panel. You see it right here? Some might be different. They might have an engine in the back, but this one runs off the, the in main engine. But anyway, so you get started. You see it's on uh, it's on standby right now. This is your ergo switch. The switch from raise everything up once you have everything set. But everything is set already, so what you got to do now is all I'm doing press sweep. And you see the right, left, and main broom. Everything's moving. It's already set. And then this one, uh, the elevator comes on automatically. You see the brooms coming out? Check it out. See the broom spinning and as well as the the main broom. So this is the main broom. This is the, the elevator. Left and right gutter broom. Right? So with this one, you can, um, of course, tilt your uh, gutter brooms. If you look right here, you see this green and yellow? This this part right here is for the, the right side. This part right here is for the left side. <coughs> Excuse me. Trust me, you're not gonna use everything, but this is for your this is your main broom. This is your RPM for your main broom. To dump up and go up and down on your hopper to dump it. All of these right here are your uh, lights. Your, uh, your rotator light, your just regular spotlights, and uh, your, your um, gutter broom lights. Right here. That's it. And this is your elevator, like I said, RPMs. And this, you do this right here. If you get something caught and you'll see it jam up right here, you just hit it back and it'll uh, reverse it. And it usually works. So if you see right here, 10, 10 and 10, that's your, uh, your, PSI. So I like to keep it between 10 and 12 right now. Just as just as long as the, the, the main brooms are just barely touching the, the ground, then you're good. And then you adjust it as you as you want. So like for the main broom, if you want to adjust it, you go down here. These two right here, for the right, for the left. You can put more or less if you want. Same thing with the um, with the elevator, I mean with the with the gutter brooms, tilt, and then you know you can just do the pressure psi, bring the pressure uh, 27 to 28. That's why I keep it when it, you know, and as it goes down, as you wear them down, then you're gonna have to adjust it and all that. But you know it's self-explanatory. Tilt and then, like I said, you can raise it up raise the rpms up or you can raise them down and you know like that so and then these are your presets right here all these right here so if you want to raise it up and say you about to pick up and take off onto the uh street press and long hold it see now everything is up so and then if you want to be ready to sweep again just bring it right back down there it go. There you go. So that's pretty much it, man. I mean, I hope this helps you and all that. That's this is your voltage, 14, you know, 14 uh, volts. That's your water level, 94%, and your hydraulic temperature. That's your RPMs, and everything else is self-explanatory. And just remember when. When you're done sweeping and you want to pick up, make sure to turn your PTO off. I mean, it's not going to cause harm right off the bat, but just don't drive around like that because it will cause harm later. So hope this helps you. And then make sure you turn off the key. Turn to the off position and you're good. Hope this helped. Peace. Two fingers. Out.